guys it's Emily so today I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial for you guys I'm gonna be doing a simple natural makeup look um, I actually want to show you guys like a very nice bronzy makeup look that I've been really into but it's also super simple if you're just like trying to go do errands quickly and just want to look nice and put together this is the look that you guys should do so without further ado leave a like a comment and let me know down below what you guys think of this video and let's get this started. Alright guys, I haven't done a makeup video in a minute, let me, let's be honest. But the last time you guys seen me, my hair was pretty short. Like, look how long it's getting, guys. It's insane. And if you guys are wondering, my boyfriend's back there. He's watching uh, basketball. <laughs> so, I'm just going to film my video. So. First thing I like to go in with... Um, for like a simple natural look is the Mario Facial Spray with Aloe, Cucumber, and Green Tea. It's one of my favorites. As you guys can tell, I used excessive amount. Just to hydrate the, the face. So then, I like to go in very, very little foundation. But I usually like to use the Maybelline Fit Me. Um dewy just to give it more of a natural look but I'm gonna go very little like I said guys in with it you want coverage but not too much where it looks like I personally like to wear foundation but like I also like to look like I'm not wearing any that makes sense. So, just gonna go around and do my face. Just like that. My eyebrows need to be done, guys, so don't come for me. I really desperately need to get my eyebrows done. I put a very, very light coat on it. But yeah, this is like my favorite bronzy type of look. Um, and it makes you really look like you're really put together. Because who does not want to look like they're put together? You feel me? You feel me? So now I'm going to go in with a little bit of baking powder. Just to set my eyes and stuff. I'm just going to place it where it needs to be placed. I got some on my shirt. That's okay. I feel like baking powder really sets the look also, guys. The only bad thing about this is it is really messy. So I'm just going to let my face bake. But I'm going to brush it off my eyelids. Honestly, it doesn't even look like I need concealer, but I'm going to put anyways. I'm going to set my nose also. Okay. So, we're going to go in with some concealer because these under eyes are not making it out here, guys. It is not making it out here. I look like a hot mess. Here we are. So we're gonna go in. This one doesn't have any in it. Love that for me. Where's the one I just had? You're bugging. This one's empty. No. So 
we're gonna go in with concealer. Okay, this is not working. Oh, I got translucent powder all over my contour palette. Love that for me. So we're just gonna open this with concealer. I gotta go on a makeup, a makeup shopping spree, guys. Like honestly. Okay, so we're gonna go in with this nice concealer. This is the HD NYX uh, concealer in the shade Fair, I believe. So we're gonna go in. There we go. I was like, why is it not going on my face? So we're gonna go above the eyebrow bone too, cause I have some hair growing in, and we want this little to look natural as possible. And then any red blemishes okay so now I'm gonna use the other end of the beauty blender and just lightly tap away I like to go on the base of the eye with the harder section of the beauty blender and then I'm gonna go in the lighter side for the lower part Guys, if you hear wind in the background, we're expecting a storm in the East Coast. So, it's pretty been windy by me, but we haven't got the storm yet. So, it's just like a waiting game. Love that for us. So, now I'm going to go in with this hydrating um, contour palette. And I'm going to go in with a nice big fluffy brush. And I'm going to contour my face. Now, when I'm going natural, I want to look tan while I'm at it. Bronzed out. But I don't want it to take away from my natural skin tone either. You guys do not want that either. Go down. So now I'm going to go back in with some baking powder. And just bake my face. I feel like baking really does a beneficial things, especially when you want like a bronzed type look. I'm gonna go in more on my eyebrow and my eyelid. I actually started getting back into baking because I realized how nice it is and I forgot how lovely it is. Okay, so we're gonna let that bake. We're gonna move on to the eyes. Let's go on with a little more contour. Okay. God, this breeze is everything. Okay, so I'm going to tie my hair back because I don't want the... It's better not to have baking powder all over me. So I'm going to either go in with this palette, which is the Naked um, Urban Decay Honey, and the Naked 2 palette. These are like my two favorite palettes, especially if I'm going for a natural bronzy look. But the Honey one has like more like shimmery. But it also has like nice browns in it. Highly suggest to get this palette. I've seen it. I got it on sale. I got this palette for $25, guys. It was like a huge drop. So I was like, my mom got it for me for Christmas. So to start off, we have to set the eyelid. Oh, let me see how my face looks. Oh, gosh. I have a lot of uh, baking powder on my nose. Love that for me. I did not realize. Okay. Let's just wipe that off. And then wipe off the eyelids. Let's just take all the baking powder off. Mm -hmm. 
you know what? I have to go in with some. God, this uh, translucent powder is getting everywhere. Let's go in with some. Where's my uh, concealer? I'm gonna go in with some concealer above my eyebrow bone. If I can find it. Just so I could like get rid of these hairs right here. Even though it's not really gonna do much. I'm trying to let my eyebrows grow in because I did um tweeze them too short and I did not like the way they looked. So I'm trying to let them grow out. Love that for me. Oh my god, I look crazy. I don't feel like it, that did anything. <laughs> oh, I hear thunder. Okay. Didn't really do anything. So, anyways, we're going to go in with the eyes. I'm going to do like a natural eye look, guys. Like, nothing crazy. So, I'm going to start off with this shade, Foxy. So I'm going to go in with the shade Foxy just to set the eyes. This is like the perfect makeup look if you're going out on a date, if you're running errands. Like if you just want like a simple makeup look, I highly suggest, especially if you're going on a first date. If you want me guys to do a date night, like if you guys are going on your first date or like a date night um, makeup tutorial, I'll definitely do that. I should have did that when... I think I did actually do it for Valentine's. I'm not sure. So. Yeah. So now we're going to go in with this nice big fluffy brush which I think this is the echo tools yeah the echo tools brush this is like one of my favorite brushes so I'm gonna look at the other palette first cuz okay yeah, I'm gonna go in with the shade sweet it's like very light so we're gonna go in with that one perfect we have a mirror right here so we don't have to really look at the other one and I'm gonna go in my crease with that okay really nice natural look See guys, it doesn't like overpower it, the shade. Is that the light? Yeah. My lights are flickering. <laughs> guys, it's not a ghost, it's just the weather. <laughs> okay. I hope the power doesn't go out in the midst of me filming. That would be terrible. The power never goes out. It just like it flickers here and there. But I don't know. The winds are pretty strong right now. So now I'm going to go in with the shade Hive. Right there. Right there. This is a really nice like palette. I really like that dark chocolate look. Oh, that color that they have on this. Going with Hive. Oh, I get it. They they did like like B B names for it. Like hive sting. Matt, can you shut that side window? Yeah. Guys, it's pouring. Ooh, yeah, it's coming down. Oh, you smell that? The fresh rain. So I'm gonna go in with the other side. Yeah. I'm gonna go on with that side. Okay. It's coming down, guys. 
I don't know if you guys hear that. So I'm gonna go first in with this. This is like one of my favorite things. It's kind of dirty, but it's okay. Um, is this Volumize Base Primer for the eyes. And basically what it does is make your lashes super long. I'm gonna use one of the palettes. The palette with the mirror. That was another thing that was beneficial with this palette. It, it had a mirror. I was like, yes, queen. Oh, my lips are chopped. So just go in with the first layer of it. I seen this other girl use this and I was like, ooh, her lashes were so natural. I was like, wow, how do you get them that long? And then I seen that she used this and I was like, I'm getting it. So if you want like a natural, like, especially if you're going on a date, you want like a natural look and you don't want the makeup to be like overtake. Not that it matters because like, who cares what guys think if you wear too much makeup, if you wear too little makeup, if it's something that you enjoy or makes you feel happy, do it. All right, we're gonna go with the bottom lashes. I'm gonna bring those bad boys out. I personally like the bottom lashes. All right, I'm gonna go again one more time side that side all right let that dry a little bit while that's drying we're gonna go in with some lip liner 
move on to the lifts real quick. I'm going with this darker brown for the lips. I keep going in this mirror, but I have this little mirror right here. So I go out a little bit with my lips. Um, so now we're going to go move in with the mascara. Because I don't want it to dry too much because then it won't work. So look at that, guys. Guys, don't judge my eyebrows. Look at that. And I use, I um, I actually take really good care of my eyelashes. I use like all these products to make them grow and like all these like natural oils. I use canal, canal oil, I think. so long and this just helps it like really show like naturally and I'm I forgot to tell you guys I'm using my L'Oreal telescopic mascara best mascara hands down let me know down below what you guys use as mascara because I'm always open to new makeup products make sure it's cheap because I don't got that type of money Well, I do, but makeup's expensive. Like, really expensive for no reason. And make sure you, like, play with your lashes to make sure they're not, like, stuck together. Spread them out. this I'm gonna use the telescopic on my bottom lashes because it's like the perfect brush to use for your bottom lashes see I would do this makeup look for a date night for sure like simple but sweet and you still look good So now we're going to go in with my other mascara, which is my NYX. I got this as a sample to try it out. It's called NYX On The Rise Volume um, Lift Scara. So basically this is just going to lift it. Love that for me. Whatever. This is just basically going to lift it 
different type of brush, as you guys can tell. So we're just going to lift and lift, lift, lift whatever pieces that we missed. Sorry guys, I keep blocking it. Just keep playing with your lashes until they look like how you want them to look. This side is like aggravating me. Alright. Okay, lastly, so we already did the lip liner. So we're just going to go in with this NYX soft cream, lip cream and then we're done. So guys, this is the makeup look. What do you guys think? Pretty simple. Oh, I had to clean that. Me let down my hair. What do you guys think? So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup look. Um and let me know down below if you guys do it a little different, if you do more, much more simpler than how I did it. But I go for like the eyes still, still do my lashes, um, all that good stuff. Still go in with my lips. So I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Oh, I got black on my head.